totally missed that. I don't know what happened. I, I had no control. No control. I couldn't pull up or nothing. It's toast. Walk of shame. Well, one and done for me here. I don't know what happened. It went on a death spiral. I could not, I couldn't get out of it. Just don't know what happened. The uh, back rudder was pulled out. I'm not sure. Maybe that might have, I don't know. I have no idea. Anyhow, I think she's maybe fixable. That nose is crunched in pretty good. Uh, oh well, it is what it is. All right, we're back from the field, and here is my crashed voltager. I don't know if you can see it. Basically, it landed nose first. So, uh, so we got going on here. I think the, uh, I'm going to try to straighten out the, uh, the fuselage, do a little gluing, um, yeah, we'll see what we, can, what we can do with that, see if we can straighten that baby out, but the NTSB report basically is construction error, is what I think it is, um, Basically, when I was flying up there, I had all of a sudden I just lost elevator. So I was pulling up all the way, could not get this thing to pull up, and I believe it's because the glue failed on me. Um, this whole tail basically just, I don't know, it came off, and when I tried to go up elevator, it pushed it back. See that? So. I had no elevator. Straight into the snow. So, all this part back here is fixable. Uh, I just have to re-glue it uh, using better glue this time. But the uh, cowl, probably not so much. I mean, I could use it, it just looked like crap. But, um, probably need a new one of those. The uh, carbon fiber rod here is broken you can see broken now the weird part is that there's some more parts that are broken this is not part of it there is the spinner and the uh, prop obviously this is the part that's in the back of the uh, Holds kind of like well, kind of doesn't really hold it, but it's it's back there. It's glued on back there, and that came off too. So, oh, uh, so that sucked. But the weird part is this. Check this out. The wings were perfectly fine. Now that carbon fiber rod broke, but uh, for what I can see, let's look at it. The wings were totally fine. So that's. That's a good thing. Um, I did break, not break, but bent the heck out of one of these uh, doohickeys here that I cannot remember the name of. But I, all I did was glue it, and that's back to uh, back to normal. So the other wing was fine. Um, let's see. This part here took a really good beating, as you can see. I'm debating if I should just get a new one, which I believe I'm going to. Um, yeah, this is pretty beat up. Um, and this is the part that ripped off in the front. It's right here, that could be glued on, but I don't know, we'll see. I'll see.
what we can do with this baby. But overall, it's definitely worth saving, I believe. And, uh, you know, it's part of flying. At some point, you will crash. So, there she is. Hopefully, uh, well, the parts, first of all, are all on back order. So, I don't know when the heck that's ever going to get here. So, once I get those... I will be able to put this back together again and fly her again. So there you go. Hope you guys had a little bit of fun. Um, I I kind of did and didn't at the same time. The uh, that um, Tundra really saved me because at least I had that plane to fly, and that thing always flies good. So anyhow, there she is right here. Right there. Ready to fly again. Alright guys, we'll 835 signing out. Have a great day. Peace.